Two to six years in prison for causing the death of a baby isn't justice. Those words tonight from the child's grandmother. 7 News anchor Diane Rutherford joins us now with more on what she has to say. Aaron, earlier this week, we told you about Trevor Simargo, the Ogdensburg man who pleaded guilty to manslaughter for leaving his infant daughter alone in a bathtub. He faces two to six years in prison when he's sentenced, a punishment the baby's maternal grandmother says is not justice. I wish that he would have got like a, a longer sentence than two to six. It's really emotional for you. Yeah, it is. I miss her every day. All Maxine Peets has left of her infant granddaughter, Amelia Samarco, are memories and photos. The 11 month old died after her father, Trevor Samarco, left his baby unattended in a bathtub. He fell asleep in another room. On the morning of May 11, 2022, Ogdensburg police were called here to 422 Belmont Courts. They received a report of an unconscious infant. Amelia Samarco was rushed from the apartment to Claxton Hepburn Medical Center where she was pronounced dead. She was a week shy of her first birthday. She had a life, a whole life ahead of her and it was taken right away. And it's hard to wonder what she would have been when she grew up. Then your last moments of seeing her is laying in a coffin. Trevor Samarco pleaded guilty to second degree manslaughter just as his trial was about to start. Instead of two to six years in prison, Pete's wants Samarco to spend the rest of his life behind bars. While I understand her feelings, New York state law says Causing a reckless death like this is only a class C felony. That's what we have to work with. The plea and the sentence will and do hold him accountable for that. So Marco will be sentenced on February 5th. He's currently serving up to four years in prison for an unrelated crime.